What's going on everyone? Welcome, welcome. We are back with another video. Today we are doing a long awaited sequel to our what it's really like to work at a sneaker store. I am headed down to Soul Priorities to work today. I'm gonna be filming a bit. Yeah, well, that's what we got on tap for today. Um, I'm looking forward to making the video. I really enjoy making these videos. If you like these videos and want to see more like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, go ahead and comment what you like about it. And if you don't like, comment too. Constructive criticism is always welcome. Don't be a dick though. Now I have worked there a bunch of other times since I made that first video. Now sometimes it's hard to record while you're in there just because my main priority is making sure our customers get taken care of. So if I forget to film, that's probably why because I'm taking care of people, I'm taking care of, you know, customers. Customers. I want to make sure they come back. They love their experience when they come down, come back and see me, come back and see the store. So unfortunately, if I don't film as much or I don't get that much stuff in these videos, it's, it's because of that because I want to make sure the people are taken care of. I am going to tell you I'm going to try my best to film as much stuff today as possible. But if in the event that it gets, you know, in the way of helping people, then of course I'm not going to continue to film. And you know, they're not just getting a camera shoved in their face. That's why whenever I film these videos, the camera is always pointed towards me because I know some people may not feel too comfortable with being on camera. And uh, whenever I have it up in my hand, I always make sure to let people know if they ever like, you know, are staring at it or something. I always make sure to let them people know that, uh, that it's not pointed at them, it's pointed at me. So they don't have to worry about, you know, being on camera or being on the internet. Um, now, if they want to be filmed and they want to be featured, then of course that's all up to them. The camera's typically always gonna be pointed on me. Saturday, by the way, I don't think I ever mentioned what day it is in the video so yeah I'm gonna let you know now it's a Saturday Saturdays are typically like really busy so I am prepared for it and I'm pumped so let's get to it let's sell some shoes all right I'm on my way in now I swear man I can never find parking here I'm walking all the way from the goddamn back the mall just opened too so shouldn't be that packed but damn this shit's packed I mean geez man <laughs> Awesome. Well, we have a, a bunch of different sizes of a lot of this stuff. So if you see something you like, but it's not your size, just let me know and I can look at it for you. All right. You. If you need anything, just let me know. Yeah. I think you the orange and leather Jordans, like the orange and black. Are you talking about the, or let me take a look. I think I know which ones you're talking about. Um, the Jordan ones, correct? Do you know if they're high tops or mid tops? Is this your first time here? Yeah. Awesome. Well, my name is Gio. Uh, doesn't look like I have them, but we can get anything ordered in for you. I know that we have the newest version of that color. It's called the Electro Orange. So this is the newest color of that sim of that line. It's the shattered backboard. So this is the newest one that had just recently came out. Yeah, keep looking around. I love your shirt, by the way. Oh, thank you. Do you keep up with the show at all? I do, kind of. Awesome. I'm still kind of new to it. Well, there's tons of stuff that's going to happen, so keep watching. It gets better. I've finished it. I'm on. I'm on the. I'm on the Boruto. So that one's cool. But yeah, those are all awesome. Those are all solid ones. So, well, if you need anything, just let me know. All right. Of course. How you doing? We got a bunch of different sizes of a lot of this stuff in the back. So if you see something you like, but it's not your size, just let me know and I'll go take a look for you. All right? Yeah. What you got on tow today, Marco? Got a little turbo. You know, I got that from Soul Priorities. Sheesh, a little turbo action. A no, little black metallic five action. All right, my man's Kojo here, bringing in a pair of Shadow 2.0s for us to legit check. Say what's up. He's got on Michigan's clean. I actually got a pair at the crib. I have yet to wear them. Yeah, they, they're clean. You know how to get these early because I graduated from UNCG recently. Ah, nice. Nice. Congrats. Yeah, they kept delaying it. Yeah. I was like, I just need these shoes. See, the thing is, I keep my dunks mostly dead stock because they just, they just don't wear down that great. Yeah. Like after you wear them a couple times, they don't look great. Oh, so yeah, for sure, I'm looking at these like I'm not. I feel like I keep them in pretty good condition, but the yeah. condition is horrible. Yeah, like I have black and whites, and my black and whites, um, my black and whites, they're it's like I got the ocean on my toes. Yeah, it's terrible. So yeah, I, I try to keep them. I try to wait until I 
you know, absolutely need to. Yeah. All right, so let's take a look. So you be hitting a lot of dunks for Risa, I'm assuming. Uh, actually, dunks are one of the worst ones for me. Yeah. GR Jordans are the best for me. Yeah, GR Jordans are for me. So, off rip, this is a pretty decent sign. Um, this tag right here, you want to make sure it's got, you know, adhesive on it. Okay. Because that's what Nike does. You also want to look for, you know what I'm saying, this, the, the serial number. Okay. That right there, that it's in there. And it's supposed to be red, so that's also another good sign. Okay. I, uh, I forgot. I heard scratching the inside the box if it comes off easily. Yeah, that's like also the, another thing. Yeah, comes with a sticker, so good sign. Yeah. Let's take a look. Because yeah, the dude was kind of sketchy. The dude was selling to me. He was taking like forever to ship the shoes. So I was just like. Yeah, so they no. smell good to me. Yeah, they smell good too. Yeah. Smell good. But some shoes recently, like, even though they're legit, they've been coming up with like strong paint so. so this is how it's supposed to feel. This new book feels good. Yeah, smells good. I'm gonna take a look under then, so I'll turn this off real quick. All right, so my man Kojo's pair, they're straight, they're good. Everything looks straight on them. You know, new book is good, leather's good. Check the insole, uh, black lighted them. Everything looks good, so you are good to go, my man. Of course, yeah. Appreciate you, my guy. Keep watching the videos. I really, every single person who comes in and watches my videos, like, I really appreciate it. Because, like, you know, I don't get a lot of views as of right now. So, just people, you know, viewing it at all, it means a lot. So, I don't even know how I came up across it. Like, I mean, I watch a lot of sneaker YouTube, but, like, it just popped up in my feed. I was like, wait a second. This man out here in North Carolina. Let me see where he's. <laughs> like, it's all doing? the algorithm, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's just the algorithm that pushes yeah. all that stuff out. Yeah. I mean, because I don't, I don't do none of that. Right yeah, I okay. think it is. I'll put it back in. Yeah, because yeah, I don't promote it or anything. So, mm -hmm. other than like putting it on my Instagram, where I say like, "Hey, I just put in a new," I just, um, "Hey, I just posted up a new video," stuff like that. That's the only kind of promotion I ever do on my stuff. So, yeah. all right, my guy. Yeah. I know you don't want to like. It's just I don't. I'm never. I don't work here as much as like the other people. Oh, so, okay. that's, so that's why I don't. That's why I don't record as often. I so, you. I work here maybe like once or twice a month. Yeah. So yeah. I don't know. Maybe you put on a flyer. I don't know. I don't know. Well, we'll see it. hope so pe things it will out. get bigger. You know. Yeah. I really appreciate it. All Thanks, right, man. man. Yeah. Yeah. You as well. Have a good one, man. All right. I am uh, grabbing a gold Jordan mid for somebody. Since the last time I recorded in here, we have changed up a lot in the inventory. The store is growing so much, so we had to, you know, change the layout to accommodate for all the pairs that are coming in and out. Your boy plays a small part in that, so feel good. Let's find this shoe for him. Your boy did just drop off 130 pairs last week. You know what I'm saying? Small part to play. It's all about teamwork at the end of the day. I'm literally nothing. It's all about having a good team. It's all about having good customer service, building long time customers rather than short term customers. Ooh, that was smooth. All right, I'm back here looking for, oh, there it is. I7 Pollen um, for a very nice lady out there. I don't know why these aren't doing as popular as like other ones they give me mad new love vibes gotta put this other one back um six didn't fit and she's trying on a seven she really likes them i think she's gonna pull the trigger they're a cool shoe this is mainly like you know the sizing is what she's worried about right now so she's trying on the seven and i'm about to go back out there and see if, you know which what's, what's shaking in red that's when it's recording Yeah. How you doing, ladies? What's your favorite part about working at Soul for Hours? The people. Love the people. What about the people, bro? Uh, the just details, a, a lot of them are really nice. Cool people to talk to. It's nice sharing the love of sneakers with other people. You know, it's all good vibes. Yeah. So, yeah. Definitely putting that in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's <pretty awesome. laughs> 
Thank you, folks. Y'all have a good one. Come on, fellas. How are you? We have men's shoes on the left, women's and kids' shoes are on the right. Man, this sun is beaming. Your boy, your boy glistening. Also, it's very hot. Y'all ever been to a mall and it's just like always hot? Imagine like working here for like 10 hours. It's hot as hell. Like I said in my previous video, you know, the whole point about having somebody stand out here is, you know, kind of invite people in, grab people's attention so they see the store, they see past you, they see all the cool shoes, and then they want to come inside and see what's going on. You just want as much foot traffic in the store as possible. How you doing, fellas? How are you? Uh, we got men's shoes on the left side, women's and kids are on the right. Hi, how are you doing, folks? Is everything all right so far? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. If you need anything, just let me know. We have a bunch of different sizes of a lot of this stuff in the back. Yeah, what can I do for you, boss? Pierce, Easy Pierce? Yeah, sure. What size? Uh, nine. Nine? Let me take a look. I believe we should, though. Now, is nine what you normally are, or is that a nine and Yeezy? No, no, no. This is nine. All right, so you might need a ten, because Yeezy slides fit pretty small. So, let's take a look. And you said you're looking for pure? Yeah. Right. Uh, I don't have a pure size ten, but I have a pure size eleven. Now, they do fit really small, so an eleven may work for you. Would you like to try it on? Okay. Um, let's see. In case you were open to any other colors, I have resin, in flame. I also have glow. I have soot in a 10. So uh, I'll bring out the 11 pure and then we'll go from there. I'll be right back. Size 11 pure for my guy out there. Y'all are funny. All right, here you go, boss. That is an 11. Think, what are you thinking? I might be a little too big. A little too big? Yeah, the soot? Perfect, I'll go grab it. Yeah, it's really weird, the sizing on all this stuff. Now, I know the orange ones, the end flames fit even smaller. It's, it's so weird. I'll be right back, all right? Soot, soot, soot. Oh, mother God damn it. All right, so that one's a 10 and it didn't fit. I actually do have a nine. I'll go grab the nine real quick, all right? Yeah, what's the idea of pure? Uh, pure, smallest size after the 11 is a five. All right, I will be right back. I'm gonna go grab that size nine. These Yeezy slides, so insane how they fit differently. Like different colors just fit differently. It's so fucking weird. Let's see, we are now looking for a size nine in the soot. I think I see her. All right, I am probably gonna have to put this down. Alrighty, size nine secured. Go and try that on. Amazing, I got this guy into what he wanted. He wanted a pair of foam runners and I was able to get him in what he wanted, so. One of the most satisfying parts about this, getting somebody into a shoe that they like. Stop laughing. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to America. I'm talking to y'all. Stop. He's just, he's just, oh, he's over there behind me. Just, this is about what it's like to work at a sneaker store. Your bosses laugh at you. All right, folks. We got my man's and what he wanted. Let's get him taken care of. I'll get you behind that cash register right over there, okay? So just, uh, Hop behind that gentleman right there. This guy, Matt, he's gonna get you taken care of, okay? He has the size eight foam runner. That sounds good. Towards the end of shift update, tired, my feet hurt. I'd like to go home. They, they always show you the, the glitz and the glam of being at a sneaker store, but your feet fucking hurt. You stand in all the time. All right. Gotta head back out there. So we had to replace the other rug. Well, not replace, the other one is at the cleaners. We just brought it out today. All right, fellas, y'all have a good one. Let's do a little fit check. Classic SPT, Amazon Cargos, and Wave Runners. I on DS the Wave Runners. They've been all right. They're better than if I would have worn my dunks today, which, you know, usually they're my go-to, you know? 
not too bad fit kind of hard i really really like these pants for me anyways i know a lot of people like to have you know the flashy stuff you know, like chrome hearts v loan all that stuff you know that's not really me i like inexpensive fashion i like you know getting cheap t-shirts like that. i don't like spending too much on my clothes the only exception i make is for like my shoes i'll spend a lot of money on shoes but i, I don't like spending a lot of money on clothes i think these pants were about like 30 dollars pretty solid what's up what are you talking about i was just talking about my pants That's very nice what kind of pants are they they're amazon pants no shit. yeah 30 bucks work smarter not harder people yep <laughs> he gets it he gets it all right y'all day is over i am heading back to the car gotta head home got to read my children bedtime story and get them tucked in and ready for bed so that's what's on the list for the rest of the night i am pretty tired those guys are goddamn tanks i swear because they do this like all the time they come in like four five days a week some of them seven days a week and they do this no problem but I'm here just like once every couple weeks. I'm fucking beat. My feet hurt, sweaty as hell. I wanna go home, dog. This is the end of my video. Hope you guys liked it. If you liked the video, make sure you subscribe. Hit the post notification so you can get notified whenever we post a video. Smash the like button because it helps us out with that damn algorithm. And uh, comment below. You guys are all starting to notice more and more that some people recognize me from posting these videos. And that's kind of cool. All right, guys. Peace.